welcome back in this video i am going to talk about text box and image over to this object it is not a chart it is an object we can write our free text as well as we can add some measures to make this chart i am going to go to chart i will scroll down third last is the text and image over to you as, as it shows that is written that click to add text and measures but the problem is if you click on it you don't have an option to add the measures you have to add it from the property panel at the right hand side which says add measures okay so let's say i just type my name my name is ajay kakar and i have a just click on done and I will have the text there if I want to format this I can do the basic formatting from here I can change the color of my text and I can increase the font size so like this I can create my own set of uh, text in the dashboard itself which can be a note or something like that so for our example i have a text box here showing that best performing product of the year what is the contribution what is the amount nop lapse ratio xyz so i am just listing all those over here in as a kpi okay but in a textual format the representation is very different so what else option do you actually get you can add your measure let's say sales is i will add a measure and when i click i have the sales i can just drag it over here add a space and i will have the sales number but we do have a problem saying that let's say i just remove all this I do over here and now I have it in basic but let's say this particular measure I want to color it I can color it so let's say I am giving it a canon color and now I have that color here but I cannot have conditional color saying that if the value is less than let's say 1050 then uh, you give it red else you can give it to green that sort of color expression isn't present with this particular object but yes you can add a lot in the appearance of this you can go into styling you will have the basic styling over here in background image you can even add a background image the same background image styling is actually available in the styling tab also as background image okay both are same responsive behavior means if you if it is a text or it is an image or you just don't want any responsive behavior kind of a static thing so that is also an option by default i keep it in text and image so if the object goes a little smaller it automatically adjusts so how do you how can you add a you know image over here you can add an image by just going into saying that please add a background image and this is the object itself which is adding the background image over here so this object is very useful for validation also and for showcasing some of the key points or just for your uh, landing page just for basic information 